Jesus prophesied that there is coming a time of great pressure on the earth. And those days will be gripped with four predominant negative emotions. Now Mike, he came up with this, uh, this uh, acronym called FOLD, F-O-L-D, FOLD. And FOLD actually covers these predominant negative emotions that Jesus highlights when he teaches on the subject of the end times. Uh, F stands for fear. Fear. O stands for offense. L stands for lust. And D stands for deception. Fear, offense, lust, and deception. These are the four predominantly highlighted negative emotions that will manifest in the hearts of those, paragraph A again, who are number one, disconnected from Jesus in prayer, number one and number two, who are disconnected from God's divine narrative. When we're connected, disconnected from the Lord in intimacy, in prayer, and we're disconnected from the narrative that makes our hearts vulnerable to these four uh, negative emotions. The paragraph D, the prophet Isaiah, he um, says that because of the intensity of the end time crisis, he says that youthful zeal um, or youthful resilience will not stand in that day. The pressure that is coming and that is mounting will be so intense that even youth, he says right here in Isaiah 40 verse 30, even youth, they shall faint and be weary and the young men will stumble and fall. That even the, the hope, the vibrancy of a bright future, even the physical strength, the uh, uh, almost like the emotional tank, so to speak, because of youth, he says even that reality won't be sufficient enough in order to withstand the pressure that is coming. Now what is interesting is that in 2020, we actually, I believe, began to see the initial emerging signs of the deterioration of youthful resilience. I'll say this again, in 2020, we began to see the beginnings of these signs where youthful resilience began to deteriorate. Now, again, 2020 paragraph B, because of the impact of COVID-19, um, a larger than average amount of young adults, so from the ages of 18 to 25, they reported signs of anxiety and depressive disorder at the rate of about 56%. And compared to adults, so those from 25 and older, the numbers were higher among the young adults than they were among the adults. And you can see some of the statistics there. Even you shall faint and be weary. The young men shall utterly fall. Now, the prophet Isaiah, he continues and he actually gives us a solution to this dynamic in paragraph C. The answer Isaiah gives is that the end time church is to live lives of waiting on the Lord. Living lives of waiting on the Lord. That famous verse, Isaiah 40 verse 31. But those who wait on the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings. They shall run and not be weary. They shall walk and not faint.